Hello everybody and welcome or welcome back to Tiny Rogues, the massively updated action roguelite. We are going to be checking out an update on the beta branch here today. So early to check it out that there aren't even patch notes out for it yet. So I don't entirely know everything that's been changed. I do know a bunch of the starting gifts have been tweaked. Tent was turned into a charm and recovers two hearts. Soul Scarf was absolutely gutted. Only gives you a soul heart when you recover a heart with it now. Still good ish but now i'm probably never going to take it for a different reason <laughs> i know that radio got buffed uh poison filled jar is now an enchantment and i'm very curious about that coin bag bomb pouch give you a little bit less i think key ring is untouched i think it was three uh but i'm really really curious this is better as well really really curious about the poison filled jar I don't know why, this one in particular has me curious. Just the ability to make any weapon a poison weapon means you can kind of force a build more than ever before. Uh, but I'm going to be going in with the alchemist because I have this in my head of like, you know, poison enchantment, alchemist, that sounds kind of right. Transmutation guild, find locked entrances to alchemy labs. So obviously like keys would be probably better, but whatever. Uh, that will allow you to transmute items. Now, exactly what that means, I don't know, but we'll figure it out. We'll go for as many keys as we can find, but... Uh, so this is a <laughs> trash alchemical concoction, so it does poison damage. We can use this three times. I might honestly use it on my first thing. Slowly will create a random potion, spawning it on room completion. Cool. Uh, gives you an extra flask. Okay. Nothing crazy there. As far as um, poison stuff goes, we could, it could be magic stuff, it could be dex. I don't want to... I think getting one more dex is actually kind of a nice middle ground. So that we could go one way or another, depending on, uh, you know, what weapon we find that we want. Potions are permanent. I... Oh... Oh, boy. We have to go for this, though. It's It sucks that we got both of these offered to us, because I think that both sound great. Let's get permanent potion buffs. I mean, we're the freaking alchemist, right? We kind of have to. I think we kind of have to. Let's get a couple bombs, because they could help us get keys, even, is another way to look at it. But it's going to be nice to be able to just, like get potions and not worry about them taking up inventory slot. I'm gonna get strength because I'm preemptively upset about uh, equip load already. I'm gonna... <laughs> I'm already mad in the future about equip load, so let's, um, let's get a little bit. Buy items and shop with my nothing. I don't have any uh, rerolls there. But yeah, I don't know. I think there's a little bit of possibility that it could be a fine use. Ooh, depends if we get... I do have a bomb. Boop. Heart recovered when revived. I'll take it, but I don't really want... I don't know. I don't really want the set bonus. Aw, oh, man. You know what I wouldn't mind? I wouldn't mind getting the uh, the thieves tools or whatever. That, that set bonus. Sure. Because I'm sure this is amazing... I'm sure it's great. Let's get the many bombs so that we're not screwed over in the future as much. I'm looking for the, the first key option. Oh, uh, eh. 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 I would pay 15 gold for this dice room, so therefore I shouldn't go for the gold even though it's been lucky buffed. Oh, mama. Contains simple rewards. It can even be a key, I think. Often it's going to be money. Got a key. A pair of boots. I don't want to spend my key right away. That much I know. Whoa! 75 critical hit multiplier. Forever. Mind you. Well, I don't know when I got that. <sighs> I'll do it. I should have done it earlier if I was going to do it at all, but, like, who knows how long it's going to take. It's going to help us, um, hopefully perfect the bosses and stuff. 
I mean, this damage is nuts. It's frankly stupid damage. Okay. He's gonna go brit, brit, brit. Back it up, back it up, back it up. Because, yeah, the summons are a little bit awkward. I feel like these, um... Like, the throwing weapons like this and the scrolls to a lesser extent, they're a little bit awkward to aim. So four is the max stack for this. You really, really have to lead the target. What are we going to, by the way? I guess we don't care. Uh, where did I go? I went to heaven yesterday. You know? You know, I, I'm not I'm not excited by the first floor drops, even if they're like th this is not bad, this isn't bad, but I'm going to replace it, and I know that for sure. So I'm less likely to replace this over the course of the entire run. So for that reason, I will take it. You, you know, like it seems like a good enough reason to me, right? If I might have that, if there's a chance I'll have that at the end of the game, I should take it now. I do want a new weapon, but it's weird because, you know, now I, now I have gotten this thing upgraded. Yep. Some uncommon weapons. You know what? In for a penny, in for a pound. Now that I have, uh, now that I buffed this sucker up, let's get the permanent potion because, again, it's an armory of uncommon weapons. I'm not that likely to keep that for the whole run. This potion effect does last for the whole run. Ooh. Now 30 gold. Now 30 gold. I don't know about that, man. I don't know if I... Uh, now it's starting to get a little bit... Yeah, yeah, I don't think I would... I don't think I'd give up 30 gold for... Some... Dice. So what's going on here? Drop a consumable weapon or equipment item to begin the transmutation process. Consumable weapon or equipment item. Upgrade rarity, transform into set item. Reroll type. Hold on. What happens if you upgrade the rarity of this? Oh. Upgrading the rarity of a set item just gives you a different set item. Hey. Odd. Uh, the transmutation station is very good, though. In theory. Knowing now what it does. Strength, growth, upgrade. It's feeling like I'm going for intelligence poison build. I know there's a dex one as well. I'm sure there's a strength one. But it feels like if you're going poison, you're either going, yeah, dex or intelligence. Get keys. Pretty much at all turns. Whoop. This doesn't use mana. Wait. Oh, it scales on decks. It just, we didn't know that because it was, it had the crappy modifier or whatever the heck. We didn't know that it normally does scale on decks a little bit. It still is clearly, um, mm. scales better with magic. Okay. It's this radius. So if we get something like power and it increases the AoE radius, it's surely got to improve that too, right? Holy moly! All right, but yeah, I think we maybe learn. I, I don't know. Is there a? There's got to be a poison set, right? I can't think of it off the top of my head. There's honestly, uh, there's not a ton of set items. 
you'll start to see the same ones pretty quickly. Not to say there's not, you know, a lot. I'm not not trying to content shame or anything. There's, there's so much in here, but, like, I'm trying to think. Is there a poison set? I feel like I have seen all of the set bonuses. And I'm struggling to remember a poison one. It's not to say that there isn't one. I just might have forgotten it. Oh, boy. Okay. Show me a gold. Okay. Are you a... No. On entering a boss room, if you don't have a soul heart, gain one. Eh. Eh. God, is this re-rollable? Do we have two? We do have two. It's wood mask or it's this, because I know, like, obviously keys could be good because I know. Yeah. But I do think we just have a reason to just take a rare item. Increased magic find is interesting. That's really interesting. That's really interesting, because we could maybe find better stuff to then transmute, you know? Hmm. <laughs> I think we go for the potions. We'll, we'll probably end up getting basically all of them. But, like, we'll do... Oh, man, I know that there's that, like, bonus power or whatever for every potion you have on. That's obviously what we want. There's probably no better character to try and find exactly the thing you want, but even still, even with the enchantment or the, uh, the alchemy rooms, it's going to be... It's going to be pretty tricky. I think we just got something we already had. Boop, boop. But yeah, looking for, I don't know, I guess like a poison scroll of some sort, maybe. I don't know what the... There's got to be a poison legendary. Obviously, there's the legendary sword, broken hero sword thing, but... It's a backup armory. I want to get rid of that because I don't want the game to think I want it. want to make sure that we are able to do the transmute room stuff and get locked room stuff. Random potion, but cursed, huh? It's fine. Can poison crit? plan here. <laughs> the very tight dodge. <laughs> Power potion. Hey, it's worth it. Alright, what are we getting rid of? Or what are we upgrading? I could try and upgrade this, but there's no guarantee. Like, I want a different weapon, so I guess I should be going to the... Yeah, I don't know. It's It's all weird. It's all weird. I could try and get the Thieves' Tool set. Oh, okay. 100% increased poison and toxic duration? I mean, not that... Yeah? Yeah? Yeah. Yeah. yeah, yeah. It's not crazy. Because don't I... already cap out poison most of the time. It's going to be nice for room clear, I suppose. But I don't think that's as good as it seems until I get the ability to, like, stack poison up to 10 or something.
God, I'm weak, though. We need to take the next um, weapon option we get. So that we can start upgrading and transmuting. Um... Yeah. There's nothing... This seems relevant. This seems relevant. But it's kind of weird, because Poison only has a max stack of five anyways. I feel like... This is the way. I do have money. Kazoo? We take it to maybe like a re-roll. Don't have very much money for the tavern. Oh, wait. I feel like... The, uh... Does the fire... It doesn't get rid of my... When you have only dealt one elemental damage type. I don't think that the Inferno Potion counts. We care more about the dex intelligence. Should we try this? I mean, it is just better than what we have right now. Cursed. It's just better. I can make a poison kazoo. But I do feel like we could just upgrade it, right? It also, um... It's not very helpful that my bullets are red. That don't help too much. Agility potion up. Hey, yay, yay. I could get this for re-rolling. Upgrading. But I upgraded the armor and it turned into a helmet, which I guess I thought that it would remain the same type. So yeah, it's not going to really be that easy to get ex an exact item. Three decks is not bad, and I don't know if I'm going to be filling up that stuff, but I'll get the quiver. I don't know. I'm going to, I'm going to see on the, the upgrade things. Good or evil? Well, we did good yesterday, so if we were to pick one, we'd go for the evil. Which means Imp Charm makes sense, then. Twenty percent increased damage to bosses. Why not? Also, zombies feels right for a uh, poison build. Yeah, I I hate I hate that my shots are red and come back to me. That makes it really tough. Okay. It looks a stack of paper bomb satisfact. Mm-hmm. I am leaning towards intelligence now. This does lightning, and we don't like that. Sound damage is not an elemental type. Hmm. Take it for re-rolling. Uh-oh. Oh. Uh. This had the potential to be very annoying. Doomerang. 
Uh, primary attack. Just whatever striking damage. I mean, I'll, I'll certainly... I'll give it a look. We got a, a legendary already. I mean, we'll see. There's a couple things I definitely I don't need. We'll keep the legendary for the time being. And then we'll use our uh, our poison jar on the last one when we finally feel like, all right, this is the one. This is already poisoned, but a little weird. Do I want to upgrade this? I'm saying no. So yeah, we're applying plenty of poison. I need to see what Doom does. I actually don't remember. Stackable fact that... Stackable satisfaction that consumes all stacks to deal 100% of accumulated infliction damage to wound damage. Okay, yeah. Sure. Basically, like, every two hits, it explodes for extra damage, basically. Two hits or four hits? I don't feel like a curse key right now. Thank you. All right, we should be doing some pretty good boss damage. And we are. Yeah, we're doing some pretty good boss damages. Oh, uh -oh. Not good. Not a good place to be. Not a good place to be. I'm, I am seeing 10 poison stacks. I thought that four was the cap. Four was the cap, wasn't it? At one point, it w they weren't. They certainly weren't getting any more than four. That's for sure. I know we could take some stuff and whatever, but. I do want to solve this cube. Two extra stam, nothing wrong with that. I'll take a couple stam. Sure. Sure, sure, fine. Intelligence. I shouldn't have sold the other thing, because, like, I kind of want to re-roll this when we get the opportunity. So I'm obviously looking for something that scales with magic. Hmm. Uh, buffs... An important note is all potions are buffs. So that's very good. Increased top and damage. Does not poison. God. The potent is pretty good. Increased top end damage, whatever. So, damage, uh, sound damage on hit, charms. Charm from this has double the effect. So they take 25% more damage at far range. By default, each point of mana grants 13... 0.75. Uh huh. Is that nerfs? I don't think the patch notes are out. It was 20. It 
was 20. Okay. Drink them all. Don't gotta worry. Don't gotta worry. Cursed candy. I actually, I mean, I do want keys. I'm trying to figure out if I want to... I'm in mana burnout. I get in mana burnout so fast, in fact. So if I were to re-roll this now, it would stay within the same type. God, I hate that name. It is a poison weapon. There's something interesting about that. For the sake of... The accuracy on the arrow is awful. It's a mimic, so... Okay. Increased damage depending on how evil you are. Great. Block charm. Those are... Fantastic. More than even before, we want uh, lots of intelligence. Oh, shoot. What's a gulp potion? I didn't even... 70% uh, faster flask drink speed is nuts. This upgrades my weapon. Which I'm happy about. I'm happy to have it without me having to pay for it, you know? Oh, boy. That's some damage. That's some damage. Hmm. Who cares? Three intelligence. So, okay. There's an argument for it. Ooh, bees grant poison stacks. I don't really... I haven't committed yet. Like, I... It's useless until it's not. Yeah, it's useless until it's not. I don't have any gloves. If I take off this, then I'm at equip load. I could take off this for a while, and then we'll figure it out. We'll, we'll know by the time we get to Satanville. And uh, with this weapon, we don't really even want to... Three intelligence, we take that. We so take that. I would like more mana. I mean, I think intelligence at all costs right now. Except for, I don't think I would take a strength down right now because... Maybe. Maybe. Volcanic Codex. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. This could be something. Necrosis, uh, primary attack does necrotic damage. It's a necrotic... There was that necrotic thing that counted... I mean, it seems like it's synergistic with poison in a way. Um, double damage. Damage over time ailments that does 50% of inf necrotic infliction damage is necrotic damage two times per sec for eight seconds. This might be... This might be it. 
It might be the thing, you know? Even though it's not the legendary, it's also... It is a plus one, and it's kind of ripping. So what happens... What What is... Reroll weapon, same class keeping rarity. That'd be the question, basically. Oh, stop. Wait, what? Same type keeping rarity? What, because it would reset the levels? I know, I don't really care. If it's because there's not another instrument? Is there not another legendary instrument? I find that hard to believe. I guess maybe we'll try and upgrade something else then, huh? It's still here. Magic find, I mean, that's been helpful, but it might be time to get rid of that. So what? Upgrade rarity. Not guaranteed to keep the same equipment type. Something. Accessory that increases your damage uh, depending on alignment. Yes, that's obviously busted. So, yeah, I'm trying to figure out why it's not a fan of that choice. But, yeah, I might, I might just go for this and buff it up. Hoping that we get, like, that necrosis synergy. It seems like it's in the same... Oh, I, I can't go in there anyways. So hoping it's in kind of like the same family. But let me just... Let me just feel this out for a little bit longer. Just a wee bit longer. I don't know. No matter what I... What happens, this feels like it's working very well. I already have this. Random trait tomes. Something about that's appealing, but... Yeah, I don't know when I pull the trigger. Because I'm on floor six... I don't know if I'm getting the the elemental focus buff. It's hard to tell. It doesn't really like show anywhere right now, which could mean that it doesn't work. Each point of mana also gives 16.25% more top end damage. Yeah. That's good. It's very good. Uh, I will be looking for... Okay. I'll be looking for more mana anyways. Dude, you know, I think it's going just fine. I think we could probably... I think we could probably end up accepting that this is just good enough. I don't think we need to dig too greedily and too deep. I think we could just buff this up unless there is a legendary poison weapon, like, right here. On kill, get berserk. Yeah, it's good. It's a, it's a buff. I don't like that. Berserk is a buff. When I kill some, then I get 32% multiplied attack and movement speed. Pretty good. There we go. I think... Huh. Maybe, maybe it's, maybe I'll get the buff now that I'm doing one type of, oh, hell. 
you know, this is worth it. To think that I could, like, have that extra charge slot, you know? Charge slot. Charm slot. I'm ripping, man. Absolutely ripping. Soul hearts are really, like, they're pretty hard to come by. Man, thinking about this not even being upgraded. I don't have enough money for the shop. Well, I think I have enough money for the shop, actually. I don't think I care about this. The music absolutely trips me up for this. Right, right, down, left. Okay, just going in a freaking circle. Don't mind that. Um, oh, grants me a luck. Can you? You have to attune to it. Nice. Yep, up, 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 up. Give me that mana star. Legendary. Hey, that that seems mana. Grant one hundred percent more mana. I think we have to take that. I think we really, really, really have to take that. Oh man. And now we like I'm I'm already pure evil and uh let's see. I think we move on. I think we move on and we upgrade yes. I mean I know I should check the evil store, but I don't want to be tempted. Because every mana star upgrade I get upgrades it twice. Lol. A hundred and two percent more top end. Seven thousand. We might not want like a like a crushing hit situation. How many potions do I not have at this point? Let's find out. It's. Yes, I know I'm one away from leveling up, but I'll still be one away from leveling up after. Lethality potion we already had. I do think we just keep this, though, actually. But I'm curious about... This is for science. This is not worth it. Kind of figured. Booze, I mean, we could. Booze, I mean, we have to, actually. I want to know. Th this is just out of curiosity. I figured. I want to know if it can. Wow, it can. It's a thing. Technically, I should keep these. I just... Don't know how much I care. Um, I don't know how much it helps the scaling. 
but I doubt that it's going to be any better than um, this, <laughs> right? Like 100%. What what will end up being 100% increased damage? So we have a we got a lot of more. So getting some increase as well. At this point, pretty silly. I don't have any bombs, so we don't even really have to care. Getting the strength up is helpful. All right. Obviously useful. Necrosis inflicted by crit does double. I have a 100% crit chance if I take this. More or less. On my second hit, sorry. Sorry to fib a moment. Legendary? Yeah, I, I could go for a legendary. All right, let's fight the boss. Huh, new floor eight boss, I guess. Just the... Kind of like leaves, I guess. I doubt I'm gonna. Yeah, it's cool. It's very cool. I'd replace boots. We'll take it for re rolling. So yeah, like, I kind of want to... I don't know. Oh... You stinker, you stinker. Whoop. Does nothing in last ten rooms. Let's go. Very funny that it is a thing. Uh, we have that one, right? Yep. I don't know. Are there any that we don't have? I'm sure there are. Just checking if it ever changes from one. Of the same type, but rarity can change. Oh. Eh. Not guaranteed to keep the same type. I wish I could just re-roll the type of this. Wait, but... Wait. Re-roll the type. Transforms into another of the same type. What? That doesn't make sense. Re-roll type. Transforms item into another of the same type. I'm doing it. Screw it. Reroll. Okay, so it did. It does do what it says, but I wouldn't call that rerolling the type. That is specifically keeping only the type. <laughs> that seems so odd. I'm not even wasting my time grabbing those. phrasing on that. I can't wait because I always get comments saying how, oh, yeah, no, you're reading that wrong. No. Reroll type is not, that's not the way you would say that. And if you do, you should rethink. <laughs> I see it. I don't have any bombs. Beep, beep, beep. Beep, beep. Tavern. Maybe I can get slightly more evil for... What just happened? 
I would like a bomb. Oh, this is uh, this is new. Gives your weapon mana drain. Pretty cool. I wouldn't mind a bomb boy. Bomb boy. Bomb boy. Bomb boy. No bomb boy. Don't want to be good. Rip. We've already got it, but I feel compelled to drink them all anyways. I'm never changing. I'm, I'm never changing my body armor. Man, where are all the bosses? The beta is bugged. There's no bosses here. Yo, that's interesting. Oh. We're getting into math territory. Increased damage depending how evil you are. So 80% flat increase or damage over time from crits, which is all of them, is doubled. The truth genuinely is everything is dying so fast that my damage over time doesn't matter. That is the truth. I'm looking for something really cheap. Yorp. So, like, since they're dying on the hits, if, if enemies had infinite health, this is how you know you're on a strong run. If enemies had infinite health, I do think this would be better, but I kill them too fast for my damage over time to matter. And that surely is not going to get any less true. 19,378 damage. Okay. Don't have the key for it, but I also don't really care. Uh, what would I get rid of? If I... Let, let, let's think about that. I wouldn't. If you get rid of Mage Blood at the last second, do they all go away? Because they would have retroactively worn off? Or... I'm not going to chance it. I'll tell you. I'll wait until somebody... Uh, somebody who's tested it and been very happy or very disappointed uh, gets back to me. I don't even want a resin. I got hit by something. <laughs> don't have very much money. I don't know why I'm even bothering. The tome, we could like preemptively get it, I guess, is part of it. Okay, so this is bad. Boop, 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 boop. Okay. Increases damage taken from crits. Is good. It's a 50% damage increase. Call me curious, but I feel like there might be something even stupider. Um, genuinely? Genuinely? If I just take off my boots, I'm always doing the 21,000 instead of the 1,800. If I just take off my boots, right? I'm down to 55.
I don't need the dodge. 20... whatever percent increase. This is maxed out. So we should be always doing the top end one now. Do I care? If it's locked, I'm upset. <laughs> yeah, the first hit... The first hit is a 50-50 if it'll crit. I mean... <laughs> the Mushroom Cap is also, let's be real, pretty useless. Berserker Gauntlets, uh... Absolutely can be useful in a boss fight because of the summons we have. Wow. He's got a lot of health. I got hit twice? Because this is supposed to refresh. I got hit twice. I don't even know when I got hit the first time. Uh, 25% increased damage over time per distinct... I... <sighs> it's probably better... It's probably better... Because, again, just thinking about literally how quickly the fights are over... Doing more damage is better than it lasting longer as a result. Boom. Ba -ba -ba -boom. Critical hit multiplier is going to be better. I think we have, like, all the potions. Ooh, this is new. What is it? Uh, ooh. I don't know if I have any trigger stuff. But I also don't want to get uh, a resin unless it happens to be the new poison resin. Wow. Yeah, like, I I just actively don't want the, the resin. Hmm. Shouldn't matter. Oh. I actually see on my second monitor that there might be patch notes out. But let me, uh, do this first. I don't think so. Also, am I overflowing? No. Let me check the patch notes real quick. <laughs> Mid-video. All right. Yeah, I looked through it. There's a ton of changes. However, I don't think there's any that I really need to, like, even go over right now. It's, it's all bits and bobs that are going to obviously make the game better. I don't know if I have any trigger damage. I just don't feel like scrolling through all of this to find out, but I really don't think I actually do. We have no booze effects. Okay. Lol. Damage over time. Is that more? God, Jesus. 74% increased damage over time. We, I've been wanting Ambrosia instead. Whoa! It's so irrelevant. That's a lot of magic finds. 
I must have lost this armor a while ago, like a long while ago. I don't think I'm changing my helmet ever. I also don't think I'm. I don't think I, I don't think I reroll a single thing I have, unless I got to 100% crit naturally. I'm at 58. No, doubling is good. Especially because there could be diminishing returns on it. I don't even know. Wait for this mana star. <laughs> and... Cool. Pretty good, pretty good, pretty good, pretty good, pretty good. Five equip load at ten percent increased movement speed. Uh I don't know, man. If we kill the summons, it it, it just doesn't it just doesn't it just doesn't matter, I don't think. Can I just I'm just gonna leave. Assert dominance by just leaving. Boop, 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 boop. All right, to hell, to hell with me. Don't mind increased attack speed, I suppose. Increased damage with non crits. So uh, this got buffed to plus ten. My question is, I'm pretty sure it's the obvious answer, and it's no. It doesn't apply to status, like, ailments. Because those are, by definition, also not crits. There's nothing in the rules that says a dog can't play basketball. You know what I'm saying? I don't, so I don't know. Ooh. I mean, multiplier. Word multiplier. That's off my, uh, my little wee-woo-wee-woo. -wee -wee. Knowing that I have a 100% crit chance, this is new as well. Increased companion damage. Uh-oh. I don't think I care about no key no mole. Ooh, who here? Add it to the pile. Uh, critical hit chance. Curse. Ooh, should basically not matter. I thought I killed it. Stamp potion. Wait, was I rewarded? Do we not? No, we have that. Lose one in the next room. We'll go for it. Lose in the next zero rooms. I do think we don't care about this anymore. Yeah. Theoretically, I lost my tipsiness, but... our stamina thing, which should be buffed up to be, yep, plus two stam. What? 
Just wait for the start. Wait for the start. Hello, sir. Whoa. My thing got, like, capped. Aw, oh, man. They buffed it. Wait. Did they? Was this like this? I don't remember. Congrats, pal. You lived the longest. Because you went invincible. I will say this change got added. Souls will magnetize towards you. Slowly. So you can avoid them even. There you go. But if you do nothing, you will get them. So you have to outrun them on purpose. So there you go. Bada bing, bada boom. Um, oh man. The question I have... The question I now have is... Is this run stronger than the two-handed soldier run? I don't know. Does it matter? No, but it might be. I just need to know for my, myself, thinking back. Also, I'm sure a bunch of people saw these patch notes and were like, Oh my god, magic builds! Ah! Because they got nerfed, kind of. The top end of magic builds was supposed to have been nerfed because they... Uh, because, quote-unquote, magic builds can get too out of hand. Don't worry. They're still stupid. If you get the right stuff. Um, dang, man. Alas, alas, though. That is that. It's gonna do it here for today. Man, oh, man. I didn't even realize you started with a good alignment. I just, I wanted to go to hell because we were, uh, we went to Hebon yesterday. So, that is that, though. It's gonna do it for today. Thank you for watching. Check the channel, Rogue Legacy Morphs. Hey, if you'd be sad to see the series go, you gotta let me know in the form of a comment down below. Thank you for watching. Thank you, thank you, and I will see you next time. Bye.